you say that you got killed as you can. Ooh, Larry's gone. Now I've been entrusted with his entire channel. Okay, all right. Uh, I'll hold it down. I won't do anything inappropriate. How you guys doing? Hey, check out 49ersqcmerch.com. I just, uh, I'm selling merch. And I'm going to be, there's going to be new designs and stuff too. So check in frequently. If there's nothing to your taste at this moment, check back next week. Because, you know, there's always going to be, and we take suggestions. I'm just going to sell stuff on you and Larry's channel. Buy my merch. Also, I'm on Cameo. You want me to say happy birthday to someone you don't like or you do like? Boom, I'm on Cameo. I could really roast you too. I won't hold back. Larry's going to have to figure, I can't, I, I actually can't leave his, I feel like I can't leave until he comes back, right? Because he can't, this is going to be live. This is rough. Because I got to, hey, catch me on my channel in 10 minutes. I'm doing a show with Rohan, who writes for 49ers Web Zone, and has been at every single day of camp. I got to say, I really respect that. Of all the people who have come, come along in the game and tried to be self-made in the 49ers journalism game, Rohan might remind me of me the most. Man, that's grinding. You can get a $5 ticket to camp and watch. I would do that if I didn't have a credential. I'll go every day, make a name for myself. He's doing it. So I'm getting on my channel, see what he thinks. I have a feeling Larry's going to have to like restart his modem. Re <laughs> Larry probably is freaking out right now, trying to call people and be like, what happened? Sorry, Larry, I got you, man. So what's up, guys? Rohan's good. Doing the best he can. I'm probably he's over there with his... I used, to do, I used to bring these to camp every day because Harbaugh used to try to mess with you. He used to try to put like hundreds of yards between the team and the media. So I would come in like, I don't care, Harbaugh. I'm, I'm prepared. Killing time on Larry's channel. He would do this for me, though. What's up, Amin? How you doing? I didn't do it, Bob. It wasn't me. 49ers QC merch. This is a great, <laughs> this is a great advertisement for my website. Who do you think is better? Why do you think Harbaugh is better than Kyle? Um, well, Harbaugh won more than Kyle. He was more consistent than Kyle. And Harbaugh, I mean, a lot of players didn't like Harbaugh. They thought he was tough on him and Kyle's the good guy. But I'll tell you something. I'll, how do quarterbacks feel about Harbaugh? How do quarterbacks feel about Kyle? Kyle's very negative towards quarterbacks. He's very critical. He doesn't build up their ego. In, in fact, he takes it down a notch every day. And then when there's an interception or something goes wrong or they lose, Kyle blames the quarterback. He never shields a quarterback from blame. What I think Harbaugh's best thing wasn't that he was a quarterback whisperer, but he was a quarterback, he was a quarterback ego stroker majorly. He was like, look, I played in the league, I was a first round pick. I got scapegoated in Chicago. I know how it feels. I know how it feels. I was thrown under the bus. So I'm not going to do that. In fact, I'm going to be your biggest advocate until I throw you under the bus and replace you. Because he really switched on Alex Smith, right? But for, for a while, Alex Smith was the greatest quarterback in the world. 